It wasn't until I recently re-watched the three Toy Story films in preparation for Toy Story 4 that I realised how much fondness I had for Toy Story 2. It's rather evident in my video about the opening sequence of that film. But Toy Story 2 really is the perfect family film. There isn't a single element that detracts from this film's story or brings down the quality. It's a constant build-up, but not one that feels like the stakes are getting higher and higher. It's more where do the characters align in their beliefs, and to be able to make Woody choose a life without Andy whilst he's still Andy's toy was so well done, as well as giving the other members of the Roundup gang reasons to be excited for a life behind glass. We also get the perfect version of Buzz, full potential light year if you like. In the previous film he was a toy, coming to terms with his reality, but found his place amongst the toys and alongside Woody. In Toy Story 3, he's flicked to demo mode, and later reset into Spanish Buzz. And while both humorous, it felt like it was solely done just to give Buzz memorable scenes, rather than servicing the story. And my main gripe with Toy Story 4 follows a similar path, with Buzz being dumbed down to give him something to do on screen, but not too much. The fact that when Woody goes missing, all the toys turn to him and he kind of doesn't know what to do, is kind of strange in parallels to this shot, or this scene, in Toy Story 2. Both a far cry from Buzz in Toy Story 2, who really shows his stance as a leader without Woody around whose intelligence and loyalty are the only reason why the toys found Woody. I think the only key toys that were underutilized were Bo, Mrs. Potato Head, and Lenny. And thankfully Toy Story 4 revitalized Bo, elevating her way above her previous outings as Woody's gal. But the adventure, the characters, the emotions, the set pieces, the dialogue. We've been detected. The walls, they're closing in. Quick, help me prop hey, up vegetable man hey, or we're done for. Put me down, you moron. It all comes together to make this the all-round best Toy Story film. When it all ends, I'll have old Buzz Lightyear to keep me company. For infinity and beyond. Yeah. <laughs>